those who don't know who I am, I'm Karen. Long story short, I left my job in the corporate world at the end of 2016 to try and pursue something new and different. That was cut short when I found out I was pregnant with identical twin boys. That led to a complicated pregnancy, to say the least, uh, where there was lots of extra monitoring. Uh, not only that, there were also medical concerns for both the babies. Um, one of those concerns eventually led to the babies being born prematurely at only 33 weeks and 5 days um, on September 20th, 2017 by C-section. Twin A was born with a right aortic arch and Twin B was born with a perforated bowel. At only two days old, he was transferred to the Alberta Children's Hospital where he underwent his first surgery. That night was a very scary one for us. Um, he basically almost didn't make it through that surgery. Um, but lucky for us, he was such a strong baby and he fought and he pulled through for us. Both the babies spent a fair amount of time in the NICU. Twin A came home to us first after a few weeks and Twin B finally came home to us for good after three months um, in between uh, different hospitals and after go undergoing his final surgery to get everything fixed. I had been thinking about blogging for a while now um, not only to share moments with friends and family, but to hopefully connect with other moms or parents out there who are dealing with the same thing or going through their own journey of raising their children. Thanks for listening to my little blurb on our story and hopefully you join us as we go through this crazy adventure. <coughs> So here are the boys. This one up here. This one is Twin B, Soren, the little brother. And that one back there is Twin A, the big brother, Kingsley. They're only a few minutes apart, but, you know. What are you saying, baby? Soren's got, um, plagiocephaly. He's got, um, a little bit of a flat spot on the back side of his head. So he's got to wear that helmet. Uh, he's had that helmet on since August, so it's been almost four months now. Hopefully we get to, um take that off permanently soon. Uh, he basically has to wear it 10, 23 hours of the day um, and we get to take it off for an hour just to wash his head and clean the helmet and stuff. Hey baby! Ooh, blurry. Hi baby! What's that? It's so hard to believe that these guys are um, 15 months old now. They've gone through from three pound little things to 17 and 20 pounders. Big brother's a little bigger here. You can tell he's a little taller, a little, little chubbier. Mommy love bang bang, huh? You want a cookie? You bang bang? Mommy love. Okay, mommy go get it for you. Okay. Okay, mommy bang bang bang. Not bang bang. Bing, bing. 
Bing bang. Gong, thank you. Thank you, mommy. Cookies always make them happy for the most part. The house is always a mess. No matter how many times you wipe or vacuum, there are always crummies everywhere. I mean everywhere. <laughs> Kingsley? Kingsley? Hi, Coco. Hi, baby. Can I share? You have some cookie? Bing, bing. Mmm, yum. See? The crumbs. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Not only do we have to worry about crummies, from these two munchkins, we have to worry about these things. No, these are not baby toys. These are all doggy toys. Lilo! Sit. Lilo, sit. This is Lilo. Our youngest fur baby. She's almost, almost two years old. Our second uh, French Bulldog. She wants the baby's cookies. She's looking for it. Lilo, come here, baby. Sit. Sit. I have a crumb in my hand here. <laughs> Trying to let everyone see her face. Lilo, sit. Good girl. This is Mila, our, our first fur baby. She's almost five, our first Frenchie. Can you sit? Sit? Good girl. Good girl. These two sisters here. Sometimes they get along, sometimes they don't. These guys, not quite walking yet, but uh, crawling and cruising around furniture. Oh, I have a little monster down here. What's that, baby? Hi, look at all those teeth. They have so much teeth. So much teeth. Hi, baby. Ah. Uh, hi. Don't eat mommy's buttons. Yucky. <laughs> Tie your giraffe. on his own here. Go walk. Take a step. Take a step. Oh, taking a couple steps. Oh. Did you just walk? Did you just walk? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, that's you. 
Do you want to die? No, be nice. Be nice. Okay, okay. Okay. What's wrong? Okay, you want to go for a nap? Let's go for a nap. Okay, okay, okay. In the morning, Friday. Um, I just got the kids down for the first nap of the day. Hopefully they'll sleep for about half an hour if I'm lucky. I had a proud mommy moment yesterday. Both the boys took their first couple of real steps on their own. So really proud of that. Uh, they'll be walking anytime soon now, I think. Hey, mommy. Hey, mommy, get up. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Le mommy, music bang and le mommy does him. Le mommy. Oh, so close, baby. Good job. Yay. Baby. <laughs> Twins, it's like this is what it's like. <laughs> What's up, baby? Why are you so cute? Soren, why are you so cute? Dai, Soren, can mommy put your helmet back on? Let's put your helmet back on. Let's put it back on, okay? Sit there, okay? Let's put your helmet back on. Put your hair out of there. What's wrong, baby? Did you hit your head? Bump your head on the table, Kingsley. You're okay. I know, you're getting a little tired. Hey? Lang Jai Mao? A little bit, please. Mommy fix it. Not yet, not yet. Mommy fix it. Hey? Lang Jai Na, look. Aren't you handsome? Aren't you handsome? Too handsome. You know you're not supposed to play fight around your brothers. You know that. It's too rough. Gentle, Soren. Gentle. Mm -hmm. Hi, baby. No biting, no biting, no, no. Don't bite your sister, it's not nice. No. Hey there. Mila. Mila. That's mommy's hair, boo. That's not funny. Ow! Oof! Ow! Ow! That's mommy's hair. Owie! Sorry. Ow! Kingsley? Kingsley, baby. Ow! Owie! Ow! Owie, baby. It hurts. Owie! Ow! Sorry, and stop pulling mommy's hair. Milo. Ow. Guys, this is life. This is life.
lots of toys, all for the little one's Christmas joy. It's the morning of Christmas Eve. The boys just woke up. It's almost 6.30 in the morning. They're here sipping on their milk. Kingsley got an ouchie yesterday. He banged the edge of the table, so his eyes a little, eyes a little bruised there. So it's gonna be a busy day. We are planning to have a very small dinner. Um, with it's just us, our household, and my brother and sister-in-law and uh, nephew. They're coming over. Um. So we're gonna get breakfast, <laughs> breakfast done for the boys, and then gonna <laughs> gonna get them bathed because you're kind of stinky. You stink. And then tidy the kitchen up a bit, and then start getting ready for um, dinner. Kingsley. After the presents. <coughs> Not yet, baby. It's only, it's only Christmas Eve. <coughs> Can you say Merry Christmas? <coughs> Merry Christmas. <coughs> <coughs> wanted to say a couple things um, before things start getting too crazy here. Last year Soren was still stuck at the Alberta Children's Hospital um, recovering from his last surgery. Uh, he, we didn't have a chance to bring him home until um, December 26th Boxing Day. So this is a very special Christmas for us even though it's not officially their first Christmas experience. Um, it is our first one with them at home. Um, and yeah, it's just uh, a very special moment for us. Sunday, December the 17th, here at the Alberta Children's Hospital again to visit Soren. So they took his tube out of his nose and we're just here outside in the lobby by the library. And there's Popo right there. Hi. And here are our babies. Our babies, Kingsley. Always sleeping. Always sleeping. And here is Soren. Hi. 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 Okay, You're okay, Okay. Get a soother back in his mouth because he likes his soother. And yeah. Okay. So we spoke to the nurse today and she said Soren's making progress, surgeons are happy with him. And tomorrow, if he does well today without the tube in his nose and tummy that we will start feeding him tomorrow hopefully that's the case and then before we know it we get to take him home right you want to come home
Kingsley. Hi, Kingsley. <laughs> it's Christmas morning. The boys are here. Having some Cheerios morning snack. Christmas morning, girls. Let's open presents. Ah. Presents. <laughs> we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Dad's side got them. Um, Avo is Portuguese for grandma. But. Thanks for tuning in, watching our video. Mm. If you enjoyed what you watched, uh, hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification, hit the like video, right, baby? Bye. Hit the like button. And um, yeah, we will continue Bye. making more videos for you guys. Thank you. Guys, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>